News Update Tevis steps down as governor of Negros Oriental. Pride Henry Tevis voluntarily relinquished his post as governor of Negros Oriental shortly before 5 p.m. Tuesday, October 11, 2022, after days of being locked in a battle over the governorship with duly elected Governor Roll de Gamo. Tevis spoke in front of a large crowd of supporters gathered at the front grounds of the capital as he thanked them, saying, it is not yet over, referring to the Supreme Court ruling giving de Gamo time to answer the arguments of the former. He expressed disappointment that the High Tribunal did not act on an application for a temporary restraining order to prevent the implementation of the Commission on Elections and Bank ruling nullifying his election victory in favor of DiGamo. A copy of the Supreme Court press briefer today said that DiGamo was given 30 days to comment on the petition filed by Tevis. The former governor, who won in the May 9 elections but whose election victory was overturned following the transfer of votes of nuisance candidate Ruel de Gamo to Roll de Gamo, had insisted on staying on at the Capitol in the past days. This, even as Department of the Interior and Local Government Secretary Benjamin Avalos Jr. ordered Regional Director Leo Cadio Travela and Provincial Director Farage Antuya to install de Gamo as governor, pursuant to the Kamalek in Bank's writ of execution. Lawyer Ferdinand Tapacho, one of the legal counsels of Tebas, previously said his client was not a party to the DiGamo versus DiGamo disqualification case and thus should not be made to suffer from the resolution of the said case. He added that DiGamo has a pending case since he already ran for the gubernatorial post for times instead of three as provided by law. Tevis left the capital with his wife, lawyers, and members of his administration with a convoy of cars waiting for them. In a statement, the Supreme Court said it took up two petitions in the Tevis de Gamo tussle but confirmed there was no action yet on the temporary restraining order sought on the declaration of Rule de Gamo as a nuisance candidate and the order to count his votes in favor of Rule de Gamo. I am Luke 090 for Dumageta Info Net Service. Thank you for watching.